Until that new shit they drop when we step on it No, I nut on a fan, make a mess on it Snap, bitch, I hit for free, you spent the check on it Bitch, don't speak on my name, put respect on it That nigga fire, why I keep a tech on me Bitch, a free, no, she just wanna set on me I put that dick out the bed like a dab, bro I do not trip off a bitch if I had her I ever took a pic with What it do, y'all? It's K, and if you didn't know, then We is on the way to Mexico This neighborhood's so quiet, everybody probably just heard me say that. Don't come, don't break it now. You gotta tell them, don't break in that house right there. Ain't nothing in there to steal, but cameras. But anyways, y'all, we are packing up because we are about to... Sound like somebody already headed to Mexico, but we about to head to Mexico, so y'all know what it is. Y'all y'all about to get ready with me, y'all ready? We y'all already packed up. Let's get ready, where we gotta go next? Gotta get a haircut, okay? I don't know what I gotta do next. I gotta get some food. I gotta find my GoPro. I got a lot to do. I got a lot of stuff to, to go finish packing too, so let's go. You know what, y'all? Before I hit the road, I'm gonna do something real special for y'all. I've been seeing this ice cream everywhere on TikTok and, and Facebook and in my DMs because people have been tagging me and sending it to me. And I just wanna go ahead and review it. The ice cream is some damn. It's like, it's okay. The ice cream is called. Cause I forgot, bitch. They go. I forgot. But I know they got a pizza flavor. They got a damn. They got all type of flavors of the ice cream. As soon as I seen pizza, I said, "Hold on, bitch. Let me see what the hell going on with this damn pizza as ice cream." I meant to say what the hell going on with this ice cream, but I had to go ahead and throw the pizza as like, bitch. I'm trying to see what the hell going on with it. So, before my flight don't take off till 6:44. And it is 10 something in the morning, so I still gotta get my hair cut out. I got a lot of time, so while I got time, I'm finna do something for y'all. Time is, 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 gotta make time treasure. Make it, make it turn it into some treasure right now. So what I'm finna do is, I'm finna eat me a little, a little, some, some food before I just start eating ice cream early in the morning. Then I'm finna get straight started into this review for y'all. Y'all ready? I don't give a fuck. Let's go. Okay, y'all, I think I wanna switch this review up. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna, uh, I got the ice creams. This is what they call. Yeah, they called uh Don't be cheating. Van Luke, wait, is this <laughs> supposed to be with this? No. Oh wait, no. Where'd you get that for? Now we gotta retake them pictures. I kinda remember the flavors. I know I got hot honey, I got pizza, I got macaroni, bourbon ch bourbon cherry, jubilee, 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 bitch. Uh wild blueberry. And planet Earth, so that's probably gonna taste like grass. So I'm gonna hurry up and do this before it starts to melt. You feel me? I'm gonna say the the craziest for last, which is the pizza and the macaroni, cause what the hell? So we are gonna start off with hot honey, okay? Y'all ready? I'm gonna start this review, so y'all kind of know how this finna go, right? I see y'all later. I'm finna throw the review on the back of it. Let's go. Where to do y'all? It's K and bitch, you know what the fuck going on. I'm back with another review. Yeah, bitch, y'all see them walls? We at the house. We been trying to find shit to review at the house. I'm tired of going to these broke ass restaurants that don't want to pay for the review, bitch. Oh well, you ain't gonna get it. Fit check, fit check. I ain't supposed to make a bitch sweat up in my house. One time I had posted a video of me in my house with a robe on. A bitch said, "Why you got a robe on?" Bitch, I'm at the motherfucking house. What you want me to be fresh as hell in the house with some Air Force? The fuck ones get on? Get the fuck out my face. Get the stumping in your Air Force ones, feet up. I've been seeing this damn ice cream on Facebook, Instagram, everywhere in my motherfucking DMs because y'all. I'll keep fucking tagging Bitch, me. the only reason I'm a reviewer is because I want to see what the fuck this pizza and this macaroni and cheese flavor talking about. This shit probably nasty as hell. Why the fuck I just said probably nasty like I ain't already tasted But the damn it. ice cream called Van Lee in. Bitch, fuck English class. I ain't even never go. Bitch, they got a pizza flavor, a hot honey flavor, a damn bourbon cherish jubilee with a jubilee, jubilee, whatever the fuck. Wild shortcake berry, bitch. I can't even read because I keep fucking. Why the fuck I ain't edited this video in a way that I will be able to read what the fuck up? Planet Earth, bitch. That's what they say. Shit. And the other flavor is mac and cheese, bitch. Yes, mac and cheese ice cream. I don't know what the fuck going on. But we gonna start off with this here hot honey, okay? Now, I'm be real. When I think of hot honey, bitch, I think of spicy honey, bitch. That shit was not spicy worth a motherfucker. Bitch, I'm trying to see. What they mean hot? You feel me? Like, what exactly did you mean by hot? I mean, I taste the motherfucking honey a little bit. The velocity of the honey could have been heavier, but I taste I it. I think it had little pieces of honey inside, too. I ain't gonna lie on it, though. It just, it went nasty. This one's good. Nothing too spectacular about it. Now that wild blueberry shortcake, bitch, I just knew that motherfucker was finna be good. I love shortcake. Short bitches, too. I just love me a bitch that I could see over. They had little pieces of blueberry some in there. I said, oh my God, this shit finna be so fucking good. Why the fuck it went? Tell me why the fuck this shit was not good as fuck. And I'm so mad about this shit. This shit made me so fucking mad. But I knew it tasted like something y'all I had to go back in and figure it's it the cool. fuck out. Mm -hmm. With the, uh, nu the nougat. 
This motherfucker tastes like a nougat. I knew I recognized that flavor from somewhere, and bitch. I ain't like nougats. I used to hate when they passed them bitches out of school, giving everybody them damn Nutri-Grain nougat bars. Bitch, if you don't get that innocent motherfucking health, they're supposed to be slow away in a motherfucking piece of candy bar out my fucking face. Bitch, fuck that. I gave that shit. That's to the bees, bitch. I also ready to try that motherfucking bourbon cherry jubilee, bitch. I ain't not, baby. I said, oh yeah, babe. I'm about to eat the Norlite. This shit. Bitch, I just knew that motherfucker was finna taste like some type of New Orleans. Cause anytime I see the word bourbon, I think about Bourbon Street. I don't give a fuck what bourbon really came from, bitch. It, it, it's New Orleans to me. And New Orleans as a whole, I think y'all should sue them. Because that shit that nasty. They shouldn't be able to put bourbon on shit if it's gonna taste like that. That that? It's some bullshit. That that? It's nasty as fuck. That that? Don't need to be sold no more. Bitch, when I think about bourbon, I think about Bourbon Street. And all them restaurants on Bourbon Street was good as fuck. Even though hey, they might have smelled a little pissy, but listen, that's, that, that, that's besides the point. Nah, Fredo, them damn hobos in New Orleans will pull they winker out right there in your face and just pee. Speaking of pee, I said, let me go ahead on and try this goddamn piece of flavor. I didn't even know who the fuck I did it was to put some goddamn pizza in ice cream. Ugh, and it looked nasty to me because I don't want to, uh marinara ice cream. Think about it together. Just disgusting. And when I say think about it, I mean just think about it. It don't it sound disgusting. Well, let me tell you how it tastes, bitch. It's good as fuck. She had me worried. I said, let me see what the fuck they put in this. I don't know how to feel about it, bitch, because it didn't taste like pizza, but it tasted like pizza. Bitch, that shit had me nervous. I started reading the motherfucking manual. How many calories in this motherfucker? Do I really need to be eating it? I can't even lie. I said it was nasty, y'all. I kept eating the shit to try to make it nasty. I'm not going to just say it was ah, good as fuck. But it went, ugh, nasty. Shit just tastes like some frozen sweet cheese. It just simply ain't nasty. I tried to make it be. It just ain't nasty. It tastes like pizza? No. It, it just truly didn't. That's what you just told a bald face this day and slide. No, it don't. It tastes like cream ass cheese and mozzarella. I taste the mozzarella or whatever. Now, I'm be real, I had high hopes for this macaroni flavor because, bitch, macaroni, you can't go wrong with macaroni no matter what you do to it. That's what I thought. I should have known when I opened up the top and it looked like a big ass block of cheese, not the fucking scoop. But look at me, my dumb ass don't follow no rules. That's the, oh my goodness, it's, I can taste it now just watching me taste. Like, who in the fuck is in charge of this ice cream? Your ass need to go to jail. Hell to be. That got to be the nastiest motherfucking ice cream I've ever had in my damn life. Bitch, I'm 23. Chocolate ice cream that my grandma used to get from the damn gas station don't even taste as bad as that. And if you know, you know that gas station ice cream ain't worth a damn, bitch. It be tasting like it and melted and froze and melted again. Bitch, I threw that goddamn ice cream so motherfucking far out my yard, I ain't even want no damn deer to eat. I'm for real. I feel like it should be illegal to put certain shit together. Cheese and ice. Fuck you. Go to jail in hell. I'm not here. That shit had me crying. Crying for real, bitch. At that point, I ain't have high hopes for shit else, bitch. I said, let me go ahead, open this shit. This one called Planet Earth, bitch. bitch. I just knew this shit was finna taste like giraffe food. Fuck. Like, why the fuck would y'all name this Planet Earth? Who the fuck wanna put the earth in their mouth? Not me. I don't put stuff in my mouth that big. That sounds zesty. It sounds like I'm putting a big ball in my mouth. Planet Earth? No. Well, to be honest. Yeah. Only if the ball tastes like this, cause, cause it was good. And not no human balls. The earth. I wouldn't put no balls in my mouth. Bitch. That shit was so fucking good, bitch. It brought back a memory. Oh my god. It's like a push up pop. I'm trying to tell y'all, I'm trying to spell y'all. Don't get none of them other fucking flavors. They nasty and they ain't worth it. Get this one, bitch. It's good as fuck. It tastes like a Superman push pop, okay? Bring back some memories, bitch. I started to cry. Cause when I used to ask my mama for one, she used to say, no, wait until we ate. Fuck you. You wait until you eat. How the hell you gonna tell me? Oh my God, I'm sorry. Yeah, bitch, fit check, fit check. So fresh, make your bitch sweat, wet. I'm sweating outside in that goddamn heat. Look at my forehead, shiny in a bitch. I just wanted to introduce y'all to my tree that I got in my backyard because I really do like this tree, so I, I feel like y'all should see it. Y'all see this tree? Yeah. Y'all be asking me, how you so smiling? You be eating all that food. I don't eat it all. What y'all be seeing me eat on them videos is probably what I ate in all. Speaking of all, dude, if you don't follow me on all apps, your ass is missing out on all this content because bitch, you be different As on all of As a matter of fact, them. let me test y'all support. If I get 2,000 shares on this Facebook video, then I I don't know what the fuck Just I'm make doing. sure y'all subscribe to my YouTube videos for longer content and vlogs. Your girl about to move to Texas, so I want y'all to come on this journey with me. Yes, I'm going to keep my house in Atlanta. Yeah, now that we got that review out the way, y'all know I gotta go get me some drip, bitch. I gotta make sure I'm fresh while I'm out of town. I'm all the way in Mexico, bitch. The Mexicans gonna think I'm dusty before I'm out there. Exactly, bitch. I'm finna, get, I'm finna go get right. Okay, y'all. We is on the way to the airport. We on the shuttle. The airport parking lot was too full, so we had to come to another parking lot then take a shuttle to the airport. All type of stuff, but just know I got some, um, I'm gonna show y'all what I got when I get to, uh, Mexico, because I can't show y'all right now. But I'm gonna show y'all what shoes I got. All I needed was some shoes when I went to set. All I needed was some shoes, so I'm gonna show y'all what I got when I get there. I'm probably gonna vlog a little bit when I get to the airport, because it's kind of two hours early, but we're gonna see. We're gonna see. Y'all finna come with me. Y'all gonna see.
Okay, y'all, we just made it successfully to the uh to Mexico. Now we're finna go get our bags, then we're gonna go get our room. So let's go get these bags first. Got our bags, now we're finna go get the cop. Listen, when y'all get to Mexico, it's gonna be the battle of the damn runners. They be like, yeah. Hey. We got deals, come here, come here. We got deals. This bitch, I see nothing. Y'all better be careful when y'all come to Mexico because these motherfuckers will lie, especially Avis ass. Don't, don't trust nobody else in the world named Avis, nah. His ass don't do nothing but lie. This motherfucker gonna tell us that the runner was there. He gave us the price. Then you walking us away telling us you finna walk us to the runner. You walk us to a truck that take us to the damn runner. Bitch, if we got to go through all this to drop that motherfucker off, we gonna be late going on. Then you lying about the price. Time I, you gave us the price, then we get all the way to this motherfucking... Shoebox ass van, you tell us motherfucking Well, because you're under 25, it may be an extra fee. No, you, when we just asked you for that total and whatever you said, that better be the total. And he talking about when we asked him how much extra it's gonna be, he said it should just be five dollars. I dare it like fuck to be more than five dollars. I dare it to be more than five dollars because I'm, I'm, I'm a snap in Mexico today. I'm a bitch, I'm a snap my motherfucking fingers. What my mom be saying, bitch, I'm a dot your eye and cross your motherfucking teeth. I ain't playing. I'm already ready to go home, and I just got here. I'm literally ready to go home. I was ready to go home on the plane. It don't make no sense. Let me try to make the best of this trip. That's what I'm gonna try to do. I'm gonna try to make the best of this trip, but other than that, I, I wanna go home. All right, y'all, after the damn, how long? After about 30 minutes, we ended up getting the rental. We literally had to sit down and wait 30 minutes for a rental to get cleaned and all that, man. Anyways, I'm gonna wait to this room. I'm going to review the room. I'm going to review the room. Well, y'all, it is. What time it is? It is 11 o'clock at night. And I and I still ain't made it to the room yet. So I'm probably not going to review it for y'all until tomorrow so y'all can see it in the sunlight. Because I want y'all to see it in the sunlight. Plus, when I got energy. But I'm going to try to do a review for y'all right quick. Uh, I just found a taco place, bitch. So... Bear with me, y'all. What it do, y'all? It's Kay, and I'm back with another review. I know it seemed like I've been slacking, but now, bitch, I've been on vacation. I'm in Mexico. Now, why the fuck y'all ain't tell me Mexico was this damn strict? Jesus Christ. I said, damn, I might not come back to Mexico. But I ain't gonna lie, I had a little fun. I had. I was fun. a little confused at the price of everything. Why the fuck shit be $200 down here? Shit, but I forgot. This shit working pesos. It working pesos, y'all. It don't, it don't, it, it, it. Basically, like, bitch, 19 pesos is $1. Bitch, I was around here using the fuck out my calculator. You think I'm a deal. Because one thing about it, in Mexico, they will get your ass. Your ass better have your damn peso translator on your side. Now, bitch. I had landed in Mexico real late, bitch. I had to find me something to eat on the side of the road. Because my girl can find shit. I said, get out the car. Let me drive. I'm going to find something. If you ask me, the goddamn street food be better than the motherfucking restaurant food sometimes. But yeah, I had to find this man right here with this little taco stand. I said, hola, well, amigo. Can I have a taco? Y'all, didn't he ask me, did I want it for here or to go? to go. I'm alive. I told him here. Sometimes I like to experience stuff that y'all probably find not good to do. I feel like, bitch, don't come to nobody else's country and tell them that they should be doing it another way. I will sit on your little bench if you want me to. Did the Dora, did the Dora, did the Dora, did the Dora, swiping or swiping, swiping or swiping. Fit check, bitch. That's how we doing it this time. I know my jacket smile. It's my girlfriend's, bitch. I don't give a damn. It look good on me. Like I told her. Fit check, fit check. Bitch, I'm in Mexico. They automatically sweat. Ooh. Now listen, when y'all do go to translate the prices from peso to dollar, do not use Google. Google is wrong as hell. How the fuck y'all gonna... Google wrong, okay? Just use a real app that might tell you the real truth. Because Google, a good and goddamn lie. 188 is not... that. Listen, it's, it's, it's a lie, okay? But when I'm out of town and I eat food like this, like street food, I overpay anyways. Just because I want to show love, bitch. Get it out the mud. I fuck And please it. don't come and talk about some... It could be germs out there in them streets. Yada yada yada, bitch. You got germs in your house, okay? Your baby daddy cheats on you every day, bitch. He brings germs home. Now I'm gonna tell y'all the truth. Y'all don't know nothing about that apple Monday. That apple Monday, they call that coke down there. Y'all don't know a damn thing about that Monday. Bitch, I'm about to order me a case of that Monday for at the house. Then that sauce right there. That sauce right there. 
Bitch, that ain't no yum yum sauce. That's some um yum yum yum. Oh shit, I'm wiggy fucked up for real though. That sauce was good as fuck. I ain't had no rice for a bitch. I had to take the little scraps that I had left, but bitch, I made it do what it do. I'm gonna be real. Sometimes I be hesitant to try food, but this time I went. I was so motherfucking hungry, bitch. I could have ate my fingernails, but I'm trying to let them grow. I'm trying to let them bitches grow so I can stop getting these baby ass fingernails. I ain't gonna get no long ass nails though. I'm just tired of getting them goddamn newborn baby nails. And for the bitches that be mad at me for getting my nails done, bitch, look at your hands. Your hands look like a construction worker. You have the hands of Shrek. The ogre. Okay, but the taco was good, y'all. That bitch was so motherfucking good, I ate Sometimes it. Sometimes I be talking so much shit, I forget to review the food. Now, y'all, they be selling coconut milk or that Coke. When I tell y'all, I don't give a fuck what they sell me down there in Mexico on the side of the street. The shit on the side of the street be so motherfucking good. I went to several restaurants down there. Sh nothing topped the streets. Nothing. Bitch, even Mexico fruit a little fresh. And that little shit right there, right there in that little container, I started to steal it. You don't tell I started the motherfucking steal it, bitch. Y'all police down there be stealing money from people. I should have just went ahead on and put it in my book bag. That goddamn chicken case of deal was that deal, bitch. That bitch was so motherf man. Get out of my face, bitch. I ain't got to, I ain't got to explain shit how good shit was good to y'all. I said it was good, it was good. Trust shit, you can trust me. Cause I be trusting y'all when y'all be fucking lying, saying that y'all follow me on Instagram. No, you didn't. I trust y'all when y'all say y'all follow me on Twitter. I promise you. No, you did not, bitch. I only have a hundred and forty-three K on there. You're a liar. Now I believe you if you say you follow me on TikTok, but you a lie if you say you subscribe to my YouTube. You is a damn lie. And I know you be lying when you say you shared my video on Facebook because why? You are a hater and I can see it in your face. <laughs> Okay, y'all. It look like it look nice at night, so I know it's gonna look good in the day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we, we have luggage. Um, let me see. I'm just trying to make sure it's the same room that we booked because we're gonna take our bag. Okay, y'all. I finally made it to my room, and I was gonna give y'all a tour, but I'm not gonna give y'all a tour yet. And I'm pr trying to see if I'm gonna give y'all a tour at all, cause I wanna go home, y'all. I came down here with my girl, and it's to the point where I, I came down here by myself for for I rather. Do my own thing for real, like y'all. Yeah, that's why I really be feeling like hell nah. I never expose my relationship to the media. Never show y'all who I fuck with because they be doing rocky shit, man. I don't mind taking my up meal flight really back home. Right now, I'm down here by myself. So, <sighs> like I'm feeling. Nah, I ain't even feeling this shit get the best of me. I'm finna do what I gotta do. Come down here work, really review shit. This what the fuck I came to do. And this what the hell I'm finna do. So I'm finna get it done. So y'all can um. This what we got going on. What it do? I'm Kay, and we're in Mexico. Come on, Vibinos. Everybody, let's go. Come on, let's get to it. I know that you can do it. Yeah, bitch, fit check, fit check. So fresh, bitch. I'm the one sweating out here, bitch. It's so motherfucking hot in Mexico. I can pass out right now doing this. Shakira, song. Shakira. Ooh, baby, when you talk like that, I ain't gonna even do it. Now, no. let me show y'all where I stayed when I went. Come along, let's go. Y'all, I got the Mexico and instantly thought I was Dora, bitch. I used to be hollering at my TV light. Do you see the entrance? Bitch, do you? Where is the entrance? Mama, I don't think this bitch Dora can see. Is that the entrance? Bitch, you tell me, I'm with you. Really? Get the fuck, oh get the motherfuck. Okay. On. I think Dora was the first bitch on earth that made me realize I ain't got the patience for certain shit. God, if you don't turn your ass around and look at that mother... God, I promise to God, if you ask me what the fuck is purple again, bitch, I'ma mix red and blue on your ass. But anyways, y'all, this little hotel resort was so motherfucking nice, bitch, it's called Moa. Now, I was in Tulum, Mexico. Now, the next time I go, I'ma go to Cancun, because in Tulum, the motherfuckers was robbing me. But if you in Tulum, this room is definitely worth it, bitch. It was worth every penny I motherfucking paid. Look at this pool, bitch. Every time I motherfucking do some shit that look like this, I be like, God damn, bitch. When I was little, I never thought I would have made it to some shit like this. They got a whole motherfucking restaurant and bar inside that motherfucker. I said, Jesus Christ. Bitch, I felt so good. Y'all know every time I go out of town, I got to jump on some shit and just scream. I learned real recently that that's some African stuff. I'ma go to Africa and figure it out, you know? So, but until then, it's uh -huh, some of the bed, and y'all, my little beastie, yeah, well, uh, yeah. Now, the goddamn hotel got beds just everywhere. It's a bed on every corner your ass look at. It's a bed, bitch. But I was not outside laying on them beds. I was hot as fuck. I ain't really see nobody outside laying on them beds. Them goddamn mosquitoes outside was bumping, bitch. If you book a room here, your ass better bring some off, because it's going to be hard to keep the mosquitoes off your ass. Now, around the resort, it's basically like a little jungle. It's like you're going through a damn jungle, bitch. I could have swore a monkey was going to come out and crank my ass up. Boost! Bitch, I was waiting on them to come clean out. Every time I reached the dead end, bitch, I turned around. They went finna get me. Uh uh. Not only do they steal stuff in Mexico, but they steal people. Bitch, I'd be damned if I go miss. Bitch, them. ooh, ah, ooh, tiki, tiki. Ooh, ah, ooh, tiki, tiki. Ayy. 
Hey, here lies the tiki land. They even got a little stripper pose out there. Self, that is not what that is. Yes, that is. All right. And they got little mirrors at every corner. So in case you want to look at yourself, you can realize that you sweating and you musty out there. Because that's all I kept getting. I kept getting motherfucking musty sweat. Get the hell out of She little. She know what you I doing. I know y'all just seen that camera on the wall. Yeah, bitch. It's a little safe. It ain't the safest, but it's a little safe. But I told y'all, anytime I reach a dead end, I run from The whole outside is basically a big ass pool. But on certain sides of the pool, it's a hot tub. Every... Some of the pool is hot, okay? And they got little cave areas and shit. Don't go down them now because because they don't go down there and get you out of the cave. I done went over there and they interrupted the folks. They over there doing a damn sound healing class and shit. They were in the court over there doing yoga. Whenever I say yoga, I like to say it like that. But not for real, though, y'all. On the way to your room, you're going to feel like you're in such a beautiful little island like a, or a jungle or something. Now, I don't know. I forgot what this thing called a damn bassinet or something, bitch. I shouldn't have got in it because it was musty. I don't know who had got in it before me, but it... They don't need to get in it no more. That thing was so musty, bitch. I was, ooh. The smell just hit me again, and I ain't even in it no more. I just know how it smells. Just, just I'm trying to tell y'all, it's like a whole house. They got a whole damn kitchen over there, a damn bedroom right there, and all of the shit is outside, okay? You ain't even made it to your goddamn room yet. They bitch. got a little spa area where you go over here in the cut and get a spa. I'm going to need them to clean out the water in this spa before I get the fuck up in it. She going to get mad at me because I wanted to play on the bed. Well, fuck it. Then. I said, let me go ahead and show y'all my room then since you want to rush your sister. I need y'all to brace y'all because this shit's so fucking cute. But like, this is my humble love. I like how they did because everything inside that motherfucker was made out of cement, even the bed. The damn bed frame was cement, bitch. Look at that bad bitch in the bed. Ooh. She was playing. I was trying to get some throat, bitch. Lock in for us, we got. The only thing I ain't really like is the fact that the bathroom was small as fuck, bitch. You can't even much go up in that hole and hit a jumping jacket. I almost broke my damn fender bone. Yeah, I need to remove that window too. Who the fuck want a window in the bathroom? Not me, bitch. And they gave us some towel rolls. I said, ooh, bitch, we finna be so sexy up in this house. Now, this was my favorite part about the whole thing, bitch. I'm gonna get one of these when I go home. I'm gonna build this shit outside my house, bitch. They got an outside motherfucking shower, bitch. When I tell you, it felt so good inside that bitch. Just rain down on me. Samba chaffa be do de rain on me. Oh, yeah, and they had a safe up in that bitch. Yeah, you could put your motherfucking bread up in there if you needed to, but I didn't. <laughs> Kept it on Because to all safes, there's a master key somewhere in this world, and you want master key me? Now, in your room, if you don't want to go use the pool like that, you get your own personal pool, too. Yeah, bitch. I promise you, a bitch can't tell me shit about my life. Bitch, I put myself in position to win off being myself. You can't fuck with me. I was like, that bitch so turned, I turned into some shit right there, bitch. Shakira, Shakira. Oh, baby, when you talk like that, you make me want to go mad. Boom. Oh, I can't fuck with that way. Yeah, I was so ready to go and get up in there and get freaky. Bitch, come on. Get out your ass up in this room. You playing. Now, if you want to make sure you don't miss no more of my content, the best thing you want to do is go subscribe to my YouTube because I drop way longer videos there. I'm about to switch my thing up a little bit. I'm about to start reviewing whole countries, whole vacations. I'm about to start reviewing everything. You feel now, me? y'all know I literally review anything and everything, but sometimes I overshadow everything that I review with all the food. So, bitch, I'm gonna still do mostly food reviews, but let y'all know I review everything. And sometimes it's not gonna be a review. Sometimes I just drop funny commentary because y'all like my voiceovers. Bitch, you want jokes and that's what I'm giving. It ain't gotta be no food around it. I love you, though. Okay, y'all, so I just reviewed the room and I like it. I like the whole resort or whatever. It's cute, but, uh, now I'm finna review they food because I'm so hungry. Damn, I'm hungry. I need to eat. What it was? Yeah, y'all, we on good terms. She decided to be cordial on the trip. So. We ain't no bad terms. We cool. I definitely did. Why would you do that? Because I never tell them nothing. And I'm not going to be that fake ass YouTube motherfucker that be lying to them. Like, we on perfect terms. Next thing you know, we mugging each other in the middle of the damn video. No. I'm going to be real. We don't know. So. We're going to make the best of this trip, though, right? Right? Tiki, tiki. I'm hungry, so I'm finna go and eat it. All right, y'all. She just went and got me some food. So why she going to give me some food? Let me explain to y'all what she don't like. She don't like when, basically, I let social media know that I'm single and stuff like that. So I, can, I guess I understand it. So I'm just going to. Stop. If, if me and her have dealings, period, I just won't speak on my relationship at all. Like, y'all just know if I'm single or if I'm taken. Y'all just know that, you feel me? But the details of it, I just don't want to speak on that shit no more. I don't even want to. That's why I feel like I don't want to have one of them social media relationships. Because then we'll get to posting about each other, posting each other, all this, everything, and everything, everybody in our business. Then motherfuckers be like, nah, they too on and off and shit like that. You feel me? That's why I don't really post about my business. You feel me? The most. The only app that really get a lot of my business is Twitter because Twitter is the place where you go and then you make a hundred posts and want nobody catch number like two. You feel me? So basically like that. But I just feel like um maybe she don't like when 
when people know that we on bad terms and stuff, which which is rare. Nobody ever know that. This that was my first time even telling y'all. That's how you know I was just I was truly upset about something because I really don't never like y'all know I don't never. But um, yeah, when you upset, sometimes you just do. You just say a lot of hurtful shit. Not hurtful shit, but just say what's on your mind, how you feel. It's like you're drunk or something. Like, when I'm drunk, I say exactly how I feel. If I see a wig and I don't like it, bitch, I do not like your wig. And I'm drunk and I'm going to tell you. But, um, anyways, I never, ever stay on topic. Because what the fuck a wig got to do with this shit? But anyways, y'all, um, she went to go and give me some food. We're going to be cordial on this trip. She went to go and give me some food. When to get here, I'm going to review it. Yeah, I really do like this hotel. Resort. It's a hotel slash resort. So yeah, I like it. But um Welcome to Mexico. Okay. It looks delicious. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you so much. What you want? Baby, I got it. What you need? Stop with it just a little bit. My girlfriend had broke up for 45 minutes or whatever down there in Mexico, so I had to record my own fit check at first. Yeah, fit check, fit check, so fresh, make everybody in this bitch sweat. Stop. Y'all, I tried to pray in Spanish, but <sighs> I ain't know how. That's but when I get home, I'm gonna go take this class that I done signed up for, and they're gonna teach me how to speak Spanish and Chinese and other languages that I never know how to speak. And as y'all can see, my girl recording, apparently, we had made up. Y'all, we be breaking up forever. I'm sick of this shit, but um, yeah. Fit check, fit check, so fresh, make your bitch. Don't judge us, bitch. At least we break up and stay in the same house. Y'all bitches break up and your hoe be in Mexico fucking somebody named Eduardo. My bitch still with me in Mexico. Now back to this food. I had got me some French toast for breakfast. They um they cater you at this here hotel. They bring it to you. The damn French toast looked like a cell phone. Bitch. Goddamn bread thicker than me, bitch. Uh-uh, I'm hating a little bit. But everything be so fresh up in that motherfucker. It was so fucking good and soft, bitch. I just had to look back at life and say, damn, I'd have made it. That smoothie was good. It just could use a little sugar. And one thing about this place, they really take pride in their fruit. So everything be fresh. I don't know what the fuck that fruit right there is, y'all. What is this fruit right here? With that, that right there that's in my hand. I never know what it is, y'all. And when I ate it, I didn't like it. So I'm re you ain't even got to tell me what it is. Now, tell me what it is so I can make sure I don't eat that. Now, y'all, this was my first time eating some papaya, too. Papaya good, but you got to pull the sweetness out of the fruit. And I ain't got time for that. Everything was damn fresh, down to the orange juice. They, peel, they, they make the orange juice fresh, bitch. Damn, I like it here. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, and comment on my YouTube channel so y'all won't miss shit else. Here now, yeah. Oh, hey, this might be the place. Uh oh, yeah, this is the place. Okay. All right, y'all. We just made it to this damn uh yoga place, and I don't think I'm dressed for no damn yoga. Sound healing. Sound healing. Yeah, sound healing. Hopefully, this heal everything. Yeah. What the fuck this bitch got me? Okay, so I guess we're trying to figure out where we're supposed to go up in this motherfucker. Oh, here. I hope goddamn fuck we don't go in here. Can I wear my socks? I'm gonna take my socks off. I'm good. I'm Christina. Do you guys want to grab some water? Yes. Yeah. Um, it's, it's either way, just fill yourself with a, a glass because you're probably going to be thirsty after the session and it's good to just bring it up with you. Oh, okay. So, mm -hmm. Oh, no, I'm dropping stuff. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Okay. No, it's okay. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Do you have your water? Perfect. So yes, we have our water. Come with me. Video? Yes. Okay. Is that a video? Sure. Yeah. How are you? Uh, like five months ago 
Yes. Yeah. Why why I, I combine these two techniques, Reiki and sound healing? Because they are very powerful together. <laughs> Actually because these bowls are made with quartz, yes. And the quartz are the mother mother of the stones. Why? Because they expand the energy and they don't absorb energy, so they're very, very powerful. Yes, and also the vibration of the sound helps a lot to regenerate our cells. Yes, and also to release all the toxins that we have in our body. So that's why I combine them. Yes, so I start playing the balls, and then I go with most highest frequency chakras. Right. So the third eye is very connected with our intuition, yes, and also give us clarity, yes. And the crown uh, is what I use to do Reiki. You know? My teacher opened this chakra to me so I can receive the energy of the source, yes. So this chakra is our more spiritual chakra, yes. It's you can connect with your higher self when you meditate, and uh, also it's very connected with our dimensions. Yes. So that are the seven main chakras. Why we have these seven main chakras? Because why they are most important than the other chakras that we have in our body? Because they are connected with our organs, physical organs. That's why. So I also have seven balls because they are connected with your chakras. So this is the root. This is the sexuality, the solar plexus the heart, the throat, the third eye, and the crown. Yes, great. So, uh, I think that I told you everything. you have any question or any doubt about what it's Reiki or about what it's sound healing? No? What exactly does the sound healing as it like? Oh, okay. The sound helps you to enter in this meditation state that we call Theta. Theta state is a state that you feel like your your body very heavy, super heavy, and because you are actually because you are very light, no? it's like your soul go away of your body and your body stay here in this dimension, and then you like your soul go, goes away. Of course, they go back again to your body, uh, but this that's why we call a Theta state. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we are gonna start doing some breathing. Oh dear. I ain't trying to look like, but I feel like nothing. You know, like, like literally, I was too much stuff when I came. Now I don't feel like nothing. Yet. That's good. Yeah, you just need to stay that way. Get to stay that way. But I do this at home, but I don't do it the right way. Apparently. This, I think the sounds was. Yeah, the, the same meditation music. Yeah. Oh man, here we are. Your yeah. turn. Is there a proper way to meditate? Yes. <laughs> the deer. It's like deer. It's a deer. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, the mother. That card appears when like um, new birth or when like new changes. Mm -hmm. But I guess I feel it. I feel it. But I don't know. I'm probably trying to block. Not feel it. Receive your message, each one. 
I hope you like the experience uh, <laughs> and I'm very grateful that you're here and also again I want to say thanks to trust me and to trust my energy it's very okay yeah we just left from doing yoga and I ain't gonna lie, I'm going home and I'm gonna sign up for some shit like that at, at home too. But it, it probably don't even hit the same in Atlanta. But that shit does just. That shit right there hit different. Feel me? That shit hit different. How you feel, though? How you feel, Steve? It was like, I feel like it was pushing it out. She it said really it was pushing was. it out. Okay, okay she's talking about a headache, y'all. Something is so good. Pushing a headache out, like, now, baby. I kept feeling like, like for some reason, I kept feeling like swimming. Like, my arms wanted to swim yes, like, it was like so weird. i wanted to swim like i was like literally just there and i didn't do because i'm like why did y'all see the waves or that's what i was gonna say i would say it'd be crazy because yeah. your eyes be closed but you still you see still something see, you still like, see, like yeah like, okay y'all i ain't tell y'all last night i had went the wrong way right down on the freeway well not the freeway what the fuck i'm talking about bitch let me rewind it okay so i ain't tell y'all i had went the wrong way like the wrong way for two seconds bitch i, I turned down the wrong one way bitch they the police Turn their lights on, got behind us, and, and literally made me pay them $50 for going the wrong way. Bitch, when I tell you I don't fuck with Mexico, I'm not lying. I don't fuck with Mexico. You know, I fuck with Mexico, but not their police. They just broke because he ain't even signed no, no, he didn't write a ticket or nothing. He didn't write no type of slip or nothing. He put that $50 in his pocket. These motherfuckers down here just ain't right. They they doing it to tourist tours, though, so y'all got to be careful when y'all get down here. Make sure y'all read all the signs and shit. When I came down here, y'all, I was mad as fuck. Like, just mad at the world. I don't even know. I can't even pinpoint what the fuck I'm mad at. Now I feel better. I ain't mad about shit no more. Oh. All right, y'all. We just, um, damn, that bird laughed. Bird just. <laughs> but y'all, we on this strip. I don't know where we at, y'all. But I know I should have walked me some banana tree. Oh, it's a banana tree. A big tree. It's a big tree. We're trying to find some, some, uh -huh. something to eat and some souvenirs. So, yeah. Yeah, we're going to eat at the big house. That's all. Yeah. What to do, y'all? It's Kane. You already know what the fuck I'm finna say. If a bitch will get wrong, she get sprayed. I been a mother of mm, Yeah, bitch. That was off the fucking dollar. Hold on, hold on. Let me kill this shit. Let me kill this bitch, shit. Bitch, I'm back with a review. If you get wrong, then I'ma knock out your tooth. What the fuck you wanna do? Yeah, bitch, go and get your crew. Yeah, bitch, what? Nah, for real, y'all. It's Kane. I'm back with another review. And bitch, I'm in Mexico. And if you didn't know, then that mean you a hater, bitch. Because I told y'all I was in Mexico the other day. Like, the fuck? Now, we was trying to find somewhere to eat. And we'd found somewhere downtown called Zaza. And I'm like, yeah, I gotta eat hell. Because, like, bitch, I smoked it. So, yeah, bitch, fit check, fit check. So so fresh, make your eyes swim so fucking bad. I had to take my shirt off and took my chain because bitches in Mexico be stealing. Now, certain places I be scared in Mexico. I had to tuck my chain, bitch. I heard they be right here grabbing motherfuckers by their throat. But if you ask me, for the most part, my experience with Mexicans down there was very good. Didn't nobody bother me. Wasn't nobody mean. Nobody but the police is what they stealing ass. I wonder how much do they get paid? Three dollars an hour? Cause they damn sure was stealing from me, bitch. I gave they ass so much money in cash just trying to get away from bullshit. They made me pay them for going the wrong way. I had to get them a ticket for my cosmetic, like something that was not inside of it. Yeah. Some bullshit. But anyways, as y'all can see from the menu, I had ordered all oh, damn cinnamon burger that didn't taste now nothing like cinnamon that came with some onion rings. And I had ordered a roast meat from home. The roast meat from home was basically a steak, okay? That's what it was. Now my girl had some sea and smoke tacos with some basically it was some K-Rab in it. Cause look how fucking look at the legs of the damn rat. Her friend had got a sandwich. I don't know what type so of So y'all know I'm in Mexico with my girl and her friend because it's her friend's birthday so my girl didn't want to go by herself so I came basically to be her wallet. Fuck this shit. I'm just playing. She ain't no gold digger. She just ain't messing with no broke bigger. And I said bigger because I'm a bitch. Now I can say them damn um, onion rings that y'all had. Them motherfuckers was so good, bitch. When y'all go to Mexico, go to Zaza and get the goddamn onion rings, bitch. The velocity of how they was cut thin and fried to the magnitude of my motherfucking liking, bitch. She asked me because she have one. I said no. That don't mean shit in these relationships. No more. I'm trying to tell y'all. Why the fuck y'all ain't tell me that? Even though the cinnamon burger didn't taste like cinnamon at all, the way that motherfucking drip, bitch. Oh, goodness gracious. You got to understand that I'm finna let y'all know how wet that goddamn burger was. That damn burger was wetter than a stud, bitch. Y'all know how studs get up under them damn boxes, bitch. You got some good ass some some up under them. Else. Well, if you don't, I do. Y'all know how these studs be trying to be so hard. Hell no, nah, I don't get with Oh, okay, you fucking robot. Bitch, I turns into a waterfall. Last bitch, I was fucking with nicknamed me Faucet. What that take? I went on to try her damn tacos. The damn, the damn legs is right. Did they, was they supposed to, I guess they wouldn't post the peel it or something. Keeping the shell on it made it crunchy, you know what I'm saying? I understood what they was trying to do, you know. I understood it. Would I personally order it? No. But when I tell y'all Mexico, the only place they got some good avocado, I don't even fuck, I fuck with avocado. I ain't gonna lie. It just, sometimes I don't know how people don't like avocado it. Avocado can't make the food taste bad because it don't taste like nothing unless you make it. So if you put it on the food, it should enhance it, bitch. So never mind, bitch. Back to the goddamn review. The guy, uh, that, that damn steak, 
It was good as fuck. But one thing about Mexico, if you tell them well done, they're going to tell you they don't want to cook it well done. On my mama, every restaurant I went to, I said well done. They said no. We don't really do well done because it's too tough. How the fuck you going to tell me how to get my meat, sir? The only reason I went mad at it because it went leaking blood. I mean, I seen blood, but it wasn't leaking, okay? So... Okay. When cooked properly, medium well, it's actually really good. It tastes exquisite. You want to know what else is exquisite? My Facebook. You got to go and follow it and like the page to see. And my motherfucking Instagram. Man, I ain't finna say that shit no more. Yes, I am. I'm gonna see it in my next video. Alright, y'all. We just reviewed this place called Zaza. So now I'm finna, uh, I'm gonna go back to the room and we're gonna uh, go swimming. Okay, so y'all, we just went swimming and now we're about to eat. We are going to our, you know, we are about to order our food, then go to our room and eat because you can order your food, food at the restaurant, but then they bring it to your room. It's like, I don't know. I like it though. So, uh, yeah. All right, y'all. I'm waiting on her to bring us um our food, but she just brought us the bottle. Yes, we are cordial. Say it, baby. Say we cordial. cordial. Say it loud. We cordial. I don't like your voice. We motherfucking love it. Hey, you hear her? Hey, stop playing. Alright, so, um, she said there's no knuckle like a nash, and she's not gonna get an ash, and she's not gonna. I'm just playing, I'm stopping, I'm stopping, I'm stopping, don't cuss me. But she said, we got us some limes, we got us some oranges, and we got us some, uh, Don Julio. Yeah! We lit in Mexico. I'm, listen, I'm the perfect person to, um, vacation with. Because I don't mind spending money because I know I'm going to make it back. I spend money just to make it back. I know I'm going to make it back. All I got to do is record me spending the money. I, I just bought a bottle. Trust me, I'm going to make it back because y'all going to watch this video, ain't it? And y'all going to like and subscribe and comment. Like this video. Comment right now. Say, girl, we watching that damn video. Shut up. All right. I'm going to be quiet. Appreciate y'all. Gracias. Mucho gracias. All right, y'all. They just brought me my food. And I'm finna slit the out of this shit. All I know is this shit better be good, bitch. Ain't no fit check. Gracias. Motherfucker don't come with no damn size on it. It ain't worth telling a lie. This is my last pasta though. Come on. Okay, wait, two shrimp, three clam. <laughs> okay. Like a spaghetti sauce. It's definitely spaghetti sauce. Come on, Howard.